my channel today. Sasha and I are going to be showing you how to make homemade hummus. It's super easy. I've never made it, but she has, and it's super good. So we're going to show you today because she's a master. She's the hummus master. All right, let's get started. To start off, we have tahini, chickpeas, sun-dried tomatoes, olive oil, garlic, lemon juice, and a little bit of water, and a blender. All right, so, start with the tahini. Okay, so we're gonna start with the tahini, and basically, like, let's talk about this. What the heck is tahini? What's tahini? Read the back. All right, well, it smells weird. Looks like that. Danielle, any, any thoughts on tahini? Um, I think it's some sort of plant-based thing. Nope. No. Oh, do you know? Tell sesame me. seed. It's uh, sesame seeds. Seeds are plants. Okay, yeah, so sesame seeds. We're gonna use a fourth cup of tahini. Whatever one is. It's getting hot. <laughs> so now we're also taking one fourth cup of lemon juice. Good. Guys, a major tip that I've learned twice now is you <laughs> always want to do this right over the blender. It definitely eliminates any room for added messes. All right, so now we're going to blend this. Really? For a little bit. We just blend the tahini and the lemon juice. Just a little bit of that? Just a little. Just a little, okay. I wonder why you do that first. Do you know? Do you happen to know? I don't know. Okay. It just says that. Yep. Now we're gonna get off olive oil. We actually have avocado oil, you know. Once again, steadily sticking with the one over four. Wait, this is was half a, of one over four. Oh, half of one over four. Two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Look at the math on that. I don't know about that. Guys, we'll put the ingredients in the description below. Now we're doing a teaspoon of garlic. Okay guys, so now we're gonna put sun-dried tomatoes in, which can be replaced with any kind of flavor you want in hummus. I have also used buffalo sauce before, which oh, was very good. That was good, that was good. You guys can also replace lemon juice from lemonade. <laughs> yeah. That was done once. That was done once and it was good as well. But yeah, so we're gonna do the sun-dried tomato flavoring. And feel free to put as much in as you want, depending on what you want the flavor to be. Yeah, I wonder how much we should put in. The whole thing. Really? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so now we are gonna blend all that up. The only ingredient that is still missing from the entire mix is the garbanzo chickpea itself. We're gonna blend this now. <laughs> wow, guys. Oh, Danielle, you can you can vouch for us. You, you wanna come on here and tell them what it smells like in here? Come tell them what it smells like. I can smell it from here. <laughs> tell them what it smells like when you get even closer. Okay, let's see. Waft it. Definitely, uh, did you put garlic in there? We did. All right, yeah, yeah. let me try again. Yes! <laughs> you, you missed one. Oh, we did? We missed one. Oh! <laughs> oh. Alright, forget the one. <laughs> okay, so that one will just be left behind. So now we're gonna top it off. Sasha, take us home with the garbanzo. We're gonna do half the can first so we don't break the blenders, and then we'll throw the second half in. Oh, alright. Do we need to rinse and drain these first? We do. Okay, alright. We'll do that over the sink, <laughs> behind the scenes. Okay, so right now we just put half the can in the blender. And we're gonna blend it up. I hope we get to use this thing. <laughs> you can. Yeah, do. No. Now we're adding the rest of the can of the chickpeas, garbanzo, whatever you wanna call it. It's preference. Really. <laughs> Lift it up a little. And then they can still. <laughs> I should stop doing that. Let's see. Does that look good? Okay. So, guys, right now it's still thick. Yes, we're adding some water. Two one fourth cups to be exact. We're getting aggressive with the blending speed now. Uh, this is a good consistency now. I think so. Do you think so, Chef Sasha? Yeah, I think so. All right. Well, we will have the ultimate critic decide that. What do you think? I think it looks good. Me too. Do you think she's gonna like it? I hope so. Me too. Here we go. Danielle. Wow, look how fancy. Consistency rating. I'll give it a 
Nine. <laughs> Nine out of ten for consistency. Okay. Flavor. <laughs> One thousand. It's awesome. <laughs> Right. Carrot time. Carrot time. Let's see if it's any different with a carrot. <laughs> She's thinking. Delicious, healthy snack. This is amazing. Wow. The one thing I would do differently is not include as much tahini because you can definitely taste it. Really? Huh. You know, I don't even really know what tahini tastes like. We should do a tahini challenge where we make Emily eat a teaspoon of just free tahini. Would it grow? I don't know. We're going to find out. All right, let's do it. <laughs> tahini challenge. Sorry, we're quite I'm scared. Me? Let's eat the tahini. A little bit. A little bit scared. Whose water is this? Mine. Can I have some? Yeah. Okay. Ready? Oh my gosh. It is so good. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> oh my gosh, it tastes foul. <laughs> mm. Tahini. What the heck? That's crazy. Don't grind up sesame seeds. Leave them whole. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hopefully that gets trending. That concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another Fitty Freckles video again. Follow me on Instagram, and I will see you in my next video. Sasha, are you coming in? All right, come here really quick. Yes, immediately. Immediately, immediately. What's your favorite song right now? Where's Daniel? She's not in here. Yes, she is. I know she is. <laughs> 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 wait, wait, wait. Uh, we're done. <laughs> All right. Well, that's no, you that. What a fail. My life be like. Uh, yeah. My life be like.